Hello everyone, Corby here, and I am currently up at 3 a.m. So this is gonna be kind of like a story time slash like um, getting raw, I guess. I guess that's what I'm gonna call it. So I was getting ready to go to bed at one in the morning because I have a lack of going to sleep while in time and <laughs> I was getting ready to go to bed and it's a process. It takes a while because I like to brush my teeth, wash my face and moisturize. Why I do that, I like to listen to music or YouTube or movies. Today I was watching, I mean tonight, I was watching uh, one of my favorite YouTubers, Beth. And usually I don't get to watch her videos as much as I want to. Usually my schedule is different and sometimes I get too preoccupied with other things and I end up not getting to watch her videos when she releases them so sometimes I like to binge watch them and I always have to leave a comment on hers because it's very important I just want her to understand that I appreciate what she does and I don't want her to stop anytime soon she's just a big big outlet for me I guess and also a big inspiration for me and also way to escape kind of but also makes me think about really deep stuff and I think it's important and I think she's doing a beautiful thing with her channel and anyway I was watching her video um, creativity she was touching subjects about why she started and what creativity is and what it means to her and what it means to other people it was just a beautiful video. I watched it multiple times because I was just like, I wanted to get the full effect of it and also I was brainstorming about this video because again, she inspires me a lot. She made me remember something. One of my first videos was my coming out story. The reason I made the video was I seen not only other people doing it, but why they were doing it, why it's important that that is a thing. Certain people and certain minorities don't get enough representation. Representation is important. Everyone wants someone to look up to. The reason I made my coming out video was to inspire others to be themselves. And it's okay to be yourself. It's okay to be gay. It's okay to be whatever you want. It's not just the gay thing. It was me reaching out to other people to let them know that it's okay to be expressive with yourself, to be yourself fully. I remember my, I think it was my message behind it. I think I heard it from a movie or something. I was gonna use it as a background till end of my videos. I wanted it to be um, leaving with a positive message, but I decided not to do it anymore because I felt like it wasn't original to me. Beth really made me remember why I started to help others, to inspire others, to be creative and be themselves. And she made me realize that it's really important to remember where I came from. It's really important to remember where you came from and the reason I'm here now is because I started watching YouTube videos. <laughs> then when I came more to terms with myself, I was able to locate other creators that have similar stories as me. And recently, since the start of my channel, I felt lost somewhat of who I am, of what I wanted, want to be. I watched this one movie, it's called Little Prince, and it's on Netflix, and it's a Netflix original. I remember watching the preview for it, and it spoke to me in a beautiful way, and I was like, I have to watch this as soon as it comes out. So it came out, and there was a one part of that movie that I did not cry in it. It wasn't like, <laughs> I'm not a very emotional person to regular things people should be emotional to. Um, random acts of bravery, I will cry to that. And um, that movie was full of things like that. And deeper meanings to things I really cry about too. I don't know why, but I'm just, I'm emotional towards that. The movie was about growing up and not forgetting where you, where you started at and where you came from. And the message was really powerful for not only younger viewers, but older viewers too. For me, I'm going to start college and I'm fixing to move. As you can see, 
my room is somewhat empty. Behind you is all the boxes and everything. What the movie helped me with was I need to get in contact with my old self. I need to understand where I came from. I need to understand further of, of what I wanted as a child, what I wanted to do as a child. Because right now I'm kind of struggling with that and it, the movie really helped me realize that. And also Beth really helped me realize that. And everything has been taking me back today, like a lot. And Beth has taken me back, the movie's taken me back, my best friend has taken me back. The people in my life I am grateful for because they really, the really special people in my life, they have really made me realize that I need to be better than I was yesterday and never forget what, why I'm trying to be better than I was yesterday. Um, I just, I guess this was kind of more of a rant than getting raw. It wasn't structured at all. It was kind of all over the place, but it's nice to get my feelings out and putting them on the camera and talking to you guys. And now there's a hundred of you guys. And well, let me correct myself, 102 now. Uh, and it's really crazy that I made that that milestone. I'm I am moving on up, I guess. And it's, I find it less terrifying and more exciting that people are actually enjoying my content, enjoying my jumbled up message <laughs> that I'm trying to get across. And I'm happy that they're going on a journey with me. These next couple of years are going to be very changing for me and I feel like I'm gonna be more constant with videos and more direct of getting my point across and not having a jumbled up message anymore. But yeah, that's the end of the video and thanks again for 100 subscribers. I honestly don't know how to thank you. I have a special thing happening tomorrow and I'm going to record some footage 102 subscribers video. Anyway, until next time, I'm gonna get some sleep and bye. And if there's a crown, there has to be a king or queen.